Hello and welcome everyone, I'm Aaron the Black Dragon and welcome back to more Bayonetta Origins, Ceresa, the Lost Demon. Where we were just wandering around last time, but I think we have some... Oops, sorry Cheshire. Not what I wanted to do. But I think we can learn some new skills and stuff. Since last time, absorption. Uh, recover a little magic, that's always good. Uh, on an enemy, their movement will be slowed, that's always good. Multi-bind. Increase the capacity of spell cooldown gauge, allowing Ceres to use Thornbind twice in quick succession. Succession. Can't do that yet. I would love to do that yet, though. Well, anyway, let's go for absorption, because that's definitely a useful one. Because we're gonna do this right here at the beginning of the episode, before we move on forward and try to find out where to go next. Let's, you know, let's go for a little bit more of the Infernal Bond, why not? In the slowdown would be good, but so far I don't feel like that's a necessity for us. I think so far we're good without that. We're good here, now we have... Pick up wave, ooh. Pick up Cheshire to create a small shock with that stuns nearby enemies. That sounds fun. And for Cheshire we can get the bind combo. Oh yeah, because we have uh, the, 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 the fruit now, so yeah, let's get the bind combo. That's something good. Let's give you the first really good and strong thing that we can get there. Thanks for the firefly just flying in front of the screen. You look cute. Oh, loads tutorial. Okay, so I'm gonna go in here. Oh, interesting. Okay, so uh, let's go. Nice. Can I do that from wherever Cheshire is? That's my question for that right now. So if I go here, if Cheshire all the way over there. Yeah, apparently it doesn't matter where Cheshire is, it just dashes over there. Finish practicing? Yeah, I'm fine, I, I understand that. So Cheshire will just go and charge towards the ones that have bound. Useful! So what is that? Combo Mastery. Press the at the end of Bind Combo to perform a powerful wind wide range attack. But it looks dope. Don't have the resources for that. Dodge Dive. Ah. And this way. No. If anything, we're gonna take the stuff that helps me in combat a little bit more. If anything, we're gonna improve our combat prowess. Everything else? Yeah, whatever. But that's important to me. So nice. Got some nice upgrades there. So now, uh, we just need to figure out... Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, there's the wolf. Ah, yeah. Cheshire. No, wait. There you go, that's how you do that. Why are you up there? Is there a way that I can somehow get up to them? Can I somehow interrupt them? Intrude on them? Be a nuisance to society? They're just up there. Huh. I think they're just up there as like environmental thing. Because it does not seem like I can actually get to them and interact with them. There you go. There we go. Nice, I wanted to attack you the whole time there, but whatever. Can you give me a shield, please? Oh, nice. Just a nice little finisher there. 
I need to get back into the swing of things a little bit. Anyway, Cheshire, come back. Because it's been a while and I need to remember how the heck this game worked. Because the playing two characters at once thing, that's not the problem. But getting used to it again is the problem. But anyway, we've been over to that side. I assume that they are just here for like environmental stuff and I cannot really interact with them. So we're just gonna go for the place that I know we just opened up and that is new. Okay, but you leading me up there, meaning that I don't wanna go up there. Let's see what we find here. Just a few resources, always a big fan of a few resources. Oh yeah, I forgot the Cheshire can, the little punchies in his stuffed animal form. The little swipeys. Ah, there we are. That's how I got to you. Don't you dare! Okay, your prick. What is it with that Chester? He's such a bother. He is. But also, that's not too bad. Could have done something way worse. Anyway, we're gonna try and get to the. I nearly just ran onto those. Maybe I should have. I could have made it to the second one without having to wait around so long. I was just suspicious, is all. Oh, what? Oh! Nice, what do we have here? Wait, I looked at the wrong spot. Again, it's been a while, I need to relearn a little bit of the stuff that's going on here. Did it just make myself... Huh. Interesting, not really what I was expecting to do here. But then again... Oh, I'm here now. So does that mean there is something for me down here to do and see and look at or... Is it just so that I have a faster way around? Oh, hi. No, no, no. Ow, ow, ow. Got you. Pop. Ooh, nice. And the other one, Cheshire. Nice. It would do good. We definitely did something. Just. Oh yeah, there's a chest up there. Also there's these things. Of which I'm still not sure how to use them. Somehow? That doesn't do a thing. No. So it doesn't have anything to do with uh, wooden Cheshire is the thing that I figured out from that. But I... Huh. Huh, I might... Hmm, hold on. Let's yeet ourselves over there. Can I go down here? I can. But I cannot make that. Uh -huh. Interesting. I could not reach that. Do I need more range with Cheshire to do that? Ha! Weird. Weird, weird, weird. Anyway, let's just continue on. Let's just see where else we're gonna go. What else we'll be able to see and do. I don't trust anything yet. Just Chester again. Uh, 
Cheshire, I need you to take these things out from me, please. Anything? Oh, that just leads back out. Okay. Okay, first thing I saw where you went, but secondly, I see this. Oh, there's a spooder. Hi, little spooder. How's it going? Cutie. Okay, that doesn't do anything for me. Yeah! If anything, I think I would need to ha have would have to need to go back there once. I saw that. What the crud? I can't. What? Grab? I cannot grab. What are these things? Except for cuties? Huh. How dare they go around? Oh. Okay. So you... Bye bye. Why am I? Why is it freaking out like that? Probably because there's something that I can't go up there. Probably because there's something that I can interact with somehow, but I don't know how to be precise. Okay. Ah, there we go. Oh. Come on. Oh, that looked weird, but thanks, Cheshire. So that's what it wanted me to know. Uh, dispelling the illusion enemies. Okay, inside the distortion you will need to use your magic to dispel the illusions which draw the fairies with Siddhar. Okay. Hi there. The nice thing is they are surprisingly easy to defeat. Why was that? Huh. What way it just... Okay. Well, I'm confused right now. But anyway, let's go in here and dispel all of that fairy shenanigans there so that we actually know what the crud's going on around here. Be at least the thing that I would love to know. Well, let's see what the trial here will be. Puncture, okay. Save. Oh. Okay, we're starting from the top again. Nice. Oh, let's go. Well, puncture is what this one's called. Let's see what we're gonna have to puncture. That's fun, that's fine, that's fancy. Okay, that's an arena, so that's easy enough to understand. Nice. Okay, got that one. Let's go! Yeet them, Cheshire! 
Come back for a moment. Gonna cuddle a little bit. Okay. You take that one out. Okay. Wood gesture. Let's do that. Nicely done. Oh, that worked out. That was as smooth as possible. Oh, hi. Fancy. Bananach. Bananach, yeah. Actually, I wanted to... Well, anyway. Oh, no. No chance in that one right now. Nice. Hey, stop that. I'm done with you. So, I'm gonna... Let's just quickly do that. Okay, Cheshire, come back here for the moment. And womp. <laughs> nice and easy. Not too difficult. I honestly thought I was gonna have more problems with the combat again. I mean, I'm a lot more quiet during the combat here. Because I need to get back into it. I honestly thought I was gonna have a lot more problems than I actually ended up having right now. Let's see how I do with more difficult enemies. Nice, another pal. <laughs> Doing good with health. That's not a lot that I got out of that. Everyone just walk. Let's do the jig again. There we go, and... I've not forgotten about that part. Anyway. And... Split in reality. Oh, sawing scoops. There's still triple scoops. It still looks gorgeous. It still has like the uh, Bayonetta typical like butterfly-esque things going on around it. There's still four more turn and knock in here. Wait, did I just? Okay. First things first. Help me out here, here a little bit. There's a thing up there. Okay, there's probably a way to do that. Oh, Cheshire, come here. And yeet. Let's pull. Those are good things for you, Cheshire. We will need them. Always good to get that stuff. I mean, I really would love to have some stuff for being that as well. But overall, I'm really happy that we get stuff to upgrade either of you. Let's take a quick look on what the crowd will find else here. Because whenever you go around these places and just don't care about them afterwards, you're missing out on some vital stuff. There's something interesting going on down there. Oh, that's the fruit! That's where that is. Okay, that's below us. Huh. So that's the things that were there. So what is that? Ah. Okay. Back here?
Yeah. There we go. Okay. That was a bit difficult to figure out. But not impossible. Let's see what we get from you. Hey, more stuff. Ooh, 100. Big one. Good that we did not just run past it because that would have been a sad one. Oh, there's one of these things. How the crud do I get to you? I want them. But how? How? Let's just... Insect. <laughs> Let's just hope we can find it somehow. Oh. It's a farty one. That's farty. Okay. My assumption here is... Yeah, you can drag that somewhere. Oh! Okay. There we go. Don't disappear on me. If it disappear on me right now, I'm gonna be so cross with you. Yeah! Let's see what that is. I feel unsure about that, but let's see. Okay. Found the moon pearl! A jewel imbued with the power of the moon! That's what I get from those! A round jewel possessing the power of the moon. The source of every witch's strength enhances the ab abilities of any witches who finds it. Those are very to unlock powerful skills. So that's what they hold. Interesting, so good to know. I was already curious to see what the crud these things would hold for me in the long run. And how that would work, but those are my moon pearls, so I'm really just interested in getting them. Okay. Okay, don't just jump into the water, idiot. Got it. Uh, but I also thought the game would be nice enough to tell me that it's deep or not. But apparently no. You have to figure it out yourself, dummy. So that was a good detour. Let's just whip those things down there. They're only semi-worth it, so whatever. Don't feel too torn up on just getting them. Do I get the ability to get smaller? It looks like it, doesn't it? There's some other way for me to get down there and get that... That fruit for Chester. And I bet it's through here, but... Not right now. Okay, then let's... What's this? Something's carved here. Capture all humans who enter the forest. Okay. That's reassuring. New area. Again, weird rock. Probably has something... Uh. Hi. Who's there? Ceresa's heart leapt at the sudden voice. Understandably. Good question. Let's just say I'm the one you talk to when you want to know about the goings on in this forest. Okay. Well, I'm not a fairy, at least. 
Sure. Says the creepy voice from the shadows. Try asking me something if you don't believe me. I'll answer any <sighs> question you have. What's one plus one? Okay. Um. Have you seen any wh black wolves around the forest lately? Oh, but you're looking for a white wolf, aren't you? How, how did you know? You were a part of this forest now. That means your business has become my business. Why would I ask for a black wolf? Trust in the path you take now. It's the right one. So right. But you won't be able to find those elemental cores as easy as you think. I just kind of stumble into them. Cause too? Okay, tell me more. Like, did he have a car? There is an old circus tent fairies used to lure human children into the forest. Oh, the circus flyer that we found earlier. The crazed ringmaster and slaves poor souls there to perform in his shows until they die. Until they die? Yes! My apologies. Was that too scary? Ah, oh, yeah. But you didn't worry. You had demon of yours won't croak that easily. Let's talk about that once it gets to that point, okay? You've caused a big ruckus among those fairies since you entered this forest. Nice. That just proves they're scared of you. And that demon, of course. Nice. Well, I'm afraid I must go. I wish you both safe travels. Who the crawl are you? Huh. The voice faded away, and silence once again enveloped the forest. Yeah. And she's gone. I'd stick with it. Just who was that? Don't know. But it is weird. The forest sage, a mysterious figure who appears suddenly before Zeresa, introducing herself simply as one who knows about the goings on in the forest. She does seem well versed in the ways of Avalon and tries to provide Zeresa with guidance, uh, uh, with what guidance she can. She seems to have something of a personal vendetta against the fairies, which is likely linked at least partially to her reason for wanting to help Ceresa. Okay. Well, now there's only one slot left. Interesting. So we have to head to the circus tent. Well, I'm curious to see that. Okay, thanks for the big fate there. Wait. You're trying to lead me one way, but I see another one. So I'm gonna go down here first. It's always nice when you can, when you can uh, somewhat cheat around a little bit with movement speed. Ah, I was wondering if that was gonna be a thing in this game or not. Okay, first things first. Ow. Wampus! Oh, not what I wanted to do originally. There we go. Can't really form by anything here. Ow. Punch the thing, Cheshire. Okay. Cheshire, come back. Let's cuddle because I've got hit once. These fairies are obnoxious. Okay. Let's start it off like that. 
Oh, come on. Let's do that. Hi. Here we go. And let's bind you. I can't. Okay, Jasher, pull that thing down. But just gonna do that over and over then. Okay, cool. Did it. And do I get anything out of that as well or not? A frog silent fro fro frogs frog suddenly charging me. Now? Yep, I actually get something out of that. Cool. I fro Okay. I see eyes. I don't know what the crud dead means, but I see eyes. Yeah. Don't quite get it. Oh, there's a way here. And where there is a will, there is a way. Yeet. Don't care about the thing that's going on over there, I wanna go here. Ooh! Nice, found another sanctuary. Well, that's nice. Because that just means one thing and one thing only, and that is that I will leave this episode right here. I hope you all enjoyed it, and next time I'm gonna take a quick look at whether or not we can upgrade stuff. And if not, we're just gonna continue on. Things are getting interesting in this world now. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Bye.